Welcome to the channel. In this video, I will take you through the steps to convert geophysical SIM card into Geo eSIM using iPhone 13. So, let's get started. To convert physical SIM to eSIM, first send SMS get eSIM space 32 digit EID number space 15 digit IMEI number to 199 from your device with the physical SIM you want to convert it into eSIM. So, Open the message, write 199 in the to section and here type get eSIM, give a space and type the EID number. You can get it by going to settings and then general, here about. Scroll down a bit, you will find the EID number. Copy it by long pressing on it and tap copy. Go back to the messaging app and paste it here. Next, give a space and enter the IMEI number. So, go back to settings. After the EID number, you will find the IMEI number. This is the IMEI number for the physical SIM card. So, take the second one, which is a digital SIM. Copy it and paste it into the message. Remove spaces in the IME number if any. You will get a confirmation SMS which gives you 19 digit virtual eSIM number. Take note of it and draft a new message with the subject SIM CHG space 19 digit eSIM number you have received. You will get a message which looks something like this. Thank you for giving the request for SIM card or eSIM upgrade for your Geo number. We will share an update with you in the next 2 hours. So, we need to wait for the next update. After approximately 2 hours, I received this message. The message has information on the virtual eSIM number and the procedure to confirm eSIM activation. Next, draft a new message. In the to section, write 183. In the subject section, type 1 to confirm eSIM activation. In case you change your mind and don't want to proceed with eSIM conversion, type 2. Once you give consent to go ahead with eSIM activation, you will get an automated call like this. Press 1 to confirm, 2 to cancel. So let me press 1. You will get a confirmation message like this. Please note that you will not receive any new messages for the next 24 hours from the activation of eSIM as per regulatory guidelines. As you can see now, the physical SIM card is disabled. Now, let's go ahead and add the eSIM to the iPhone. So, go to settings. You will see this option which says geocellular plan ready to be installed. Tap on it. You get this screen. Tap continue. Here, you can add labels to each of your cellular plans. You can choose common names or custom ones. This is the eSIM. You can give a name to it here. Next, choose the default SIM for calls, iMessage and FaceTime. This screen is for selecting the default SIM for data. You can allow cellular data switching using this toggle. Tap continue. That's it. The eSIM is configured now. As you can see, the eSIM signal is showing up and the physical SIM card is showing no signal as it is deactivated. If you want to use a dual SIM card on iPhone 13, add the SIM card to the SIM card tree. Let me add an Airtel SIM card. You get the screen to add the name to the SIM card, default SIM for calls, iMessage, data, etc. Just like the way eSIM configuration. Now, both SIM cards are activated. This way, you can convert geophysical SIM card to Geo eSIM or transfer Geo eSIM from one phone to another. That's it for this video on how to use dual SIM on iPhone 13 using Geo eSIM. Thanks for watching this video. Please hit the like button if you find this video useful. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get a notification as soon as we upload new videos.